Brew temperature control, flush advisor, rotary pump. Is this a heat exchanger with dual boiler capabilities? It was pretty ambitious to have such a thought not so long ago, but not anymore. This is the ECM Mechanica Max Espresso Machine, a machine that redefines the capabilities of heat exchanger espresso machines. Hey guys, I'm Hazim from La Marsa, and today I'll be doing a review of the ECM Mechanica Max Espresso Machine. I'll be covering the usual stuff such as the overview, features, performance, and give you my final thoughts at the end of the video. The Mechanica Max is the latest model from the Mechanica line, but there are a lot of changes that ECM has made to the Max that makes this one a truly unique. First off, it is a little bit bigger than the previous Mechanica 6 Slim, but not by much, with dimensions being 27.4 cm for width, 44.5 cm for depth, and 40 cm for height. It also weighs 3 kg heavier than the Mechanica 6 Slim at 23.5 kg. It is not an ECM machine without the stainless steel mirror polish panels and the ECM logo at the back and at the front. A look that screams premium. Underneath the cup warmer is the removable water tank with a 3 liters capacity. And yes, it can also be plumbed in. The quick steam joystick toggle for the steam and hot water is what sets the max apart. And if you're worried about burning your hand, Steam 1 is insulated. There's the boiler gauge and the pump gauge in between the quick steam and good old E61 group head for optimum temperature stability. Last but not least, you have a display that gives you access to a wide range of convenience and smart features. The Mechanica Max features an insulated stainless steel boiler with a capacity of 1.9 liters, feeding from a rotary pump and there aren't that many heat exchangers with rotary pumps as far as I'm concerned. And yes, being a smart heat exchanger means that the Max is capable of brewing and steaming at the same time. To access the menu, hold the up and down button simultaneously, and then press the down button to navigate through the features. The features include brew water temperature, boiler temperature, eco mode, setting the temperature unit, schedule when to turn on or off your max, and two modes of pre-infusion among others. When using the water tank, the max offers two types of pre-infusion, active and passive pre-infusion. The active pre-infusion initiates the pump for programmable duration ranging from 1 to 10 seconds. As for passive pre-infusion, it serves two purposes. When used alongside active pre-infusion, the pump runs for the time set in the active pre-infusion stage and then pauses for program duration from 1 to 9 seconds. This intentional pause allows the coffee to expand, providing a more even extraction. However, when plumbed directly to the water line, passive pre-infusion is used on its own. In this scenario, the plumb pressure gently pushes the brew water into the coffee for the program time before the pump commences the full pressure extraction. Such a comprehensive pre-infusion system guarantees the utmost control and precision in your coffee brewing experience. The flush advisor mode, on the other hand, is pretty straightforward. When the brew temperature is too hot, it will display three dashes at the top, and you can perform a cool flush without the pot or filter. When the timer starts, push the lever down and it will display RDY. This means that the brew water is at your set temperature. Three dashes at the bottom means your brew temperature is too low. So all you have to do is wait for the temperature to increase to the set temperature and the max is all set. As for BTC, it does not mean Bitcoin, but brew temperature control mode. To put it simply, this mode limits the buildup of temperature to avoid overheating. BC1 is the slowest heating mode, BC2 is a recommended heating mode, and BC3 is the fastest heating mode that is designed for experienced users. You can find a more detailed tutorial on the many features of the Max on ECM's YouTube channel. All these features in such a compact machine must mean that the Max performs really well, right? Right. By default, the Max will be in standard heat exchanger mode, making it simple to use.
However, if you're up for some experimenting or if you are a seasoned home barista, the smart features such as the passive and active pre-infusion and the brew temperature control will come in handy. There's no shortage of steaming power too with the Max as you can achieve this by setting a higher boiler temperature. Even when engaging the brew temperature control at its lowest heating mode, you can briefly ramp up the steaming power by pressing the up button during the brewing process. Being true to the ECM philosophy, this Higgs changer machine may be compact but it surely does pack a punch. The build quality is of ECM standard, the design is timeless and fascinating, and as for the features, the brew temperature control, flush advisor, pre-infusion, and so on, are definitely game-changing for heat exchanger. The Max is the perfect heat exchanger for you if you desire an espresso machine with dual boiler capabilities without the hefty price tag. And that is it for an ECM Mechanica Max espresso machine. If you are interested in purchasing the Max, you can check out the link in the description below or you can just drop by our showroom. And if you have any questions about the Max, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next one.